What's up everyone? This is Owen, bringing you guys a brand new video. Today I'm gonna be talking about something that's a little bit personal, but not really that like sappy or anything. So we're just gonna hop right into it. I'm gonna be talking about why having diabetes in the cold sucks and it is the worst thing in the world. I don't really know how else to explain it, but I'm gonna give you some examples because I need to get this off my chest and I need to show you and tell you why I hate living in Iowa because it gets so cold here. Let's just check the temperature right now. Let's check the temperature. It is eight degrees out. Do you know what eight degrees does? Eight degrees freezes and it freezes your freaking body and it sucks so, so bad. It is, it is the worst thing in the world because when your hands get cold, it hurts to even touch them like if you get flicked or something with cold hands like it hurts like on a extreme level of pain and then let alone when you prick your finger when you do this when it is when your hands are cold you can't get any blood out you see this you know what let's let's check my blood sugar right now Not gonna say that one. Don't know why my insulin didn't work, but we're a little bit high. Another prime example would be taking an insulin shot. In the cold, you typically wear pants and a sweatshirt, long sleeves. Therefore, you rule out two sights because you can't, I mean, you can take a sweatshirt off and like, you know, get back here or here, but it's hard. It's It takes time and when you want to sh just give that shot, just quick, get it over with, that is not ideal. When you're wearing pants, you roll out another sight. So I usually, I'm wearing shorts right now and that's pretty much why I wear shorts in the winter is so I can get this site easy access. As long as I'm at home and I don't plan on going anywhere, I will wear shorts because that's just another site that I can use right here. Even my site is bruised down here. This, it, you just can't afford to lose two sites in the winter. Like, it's crucial that when you are in the summer that you use the sites that you have to you know use because if you use your stomach just a lot i've had this happen to me before your stomach builds up the scar tissue and it doesn't work as well kind of spreading out your sights is using the ones that are easy access in the winter and then in the summer give those ones a break when it gets warmer when you start to get you know you can use all of them in the winter but i'm just saying that when you are wearing shorts use the ones that you know, you don't necessarily use all the time. Another one is I found out that my Medtronic meter that goes with my pump that I do not use doesn't test when it gets cold. It told me the other day when I needed a test because I was not feeling good, it told me that it was too cold to test. So, I mean, it shot anxiety into my body and my mind just raced 100% just as it just completely escalated and so I was freaking out then I was like this wouldn't happen if I wasn't in the cold that's why I do not want to live here that's why I do not like living here and all these just stack up on top of each other make diabetes the hardest disease to control in the winter because like there's so many things against you and you have to remember to change sites use inside to your advantage wear shorts when you can or i mean i guess you can drop your pants it doesn't really matter if you're comfortable with doing that and then go ahead sometimes i do and it's whatever i don't really know if this video makes any sense or it's going to be any good or not but i just needed to get that off my chest because i cannot stand living here in the winter any longer i need to move asap i can't do it um i do have a new merch website down in the description in owenlove.com go ahead and cop some merch got two new designs on there yeah guys that's been it uh this is owen love you all peace out